Hey guys, and today we're going to be talking about Marvel's Avengers. So guys, um, I'm sorry for not posting in a while. You know, it happens. You know, once in a while you don't pose and stuff like that. So I'm sorry. But this game is about to come out, and I'm pretty excited for this. We're going to be talking about it. And first thing I want to jump into is I hope this game isn't like Marvel's Ultimate Alliance. Please. 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 Don't be like Ultimate Alliance. Be like Marvel Spider-Man. You know, that type of gameplay. God of War, you know, like, imagine in a world like God of War as the Avengers or Destiny. Amazing, really. Um, so, um, we're gonna get gameplay in about like seven days from now. And we've gotten some more information. I already uh, read this information. I've known, I think most people already know, um, but I'm just gonna read it uh, just to show you guys. And I'll be showing you in the screen if you wanna take a look at it. Um, let's, let's go ahead and let's see what it says. It says, embrace your powers and join key members of the development team at Crystal Dynamics and creative team at Marvel Games as they talk exclusively about the upcoming Marvel Avengers. Marvel Spider-Man and Marvel Avengers, they both have the same name, maybe the same universe. This is the Defining Avengers gaming experience. Defining. <laughs> An epic action adventure that combines cinematic storytelling with continuous single player and cooperative gameplay. You're going to be able to play with your friends. I like that. And it says, moderated by Andrea Rene, assembled in teams of two, four players. Four. So we're going to talk about that in a little. And combine powers to defend an ever expanding world under constant threat. So that last piece, that ever expanding world, and, you know, the constant updates, it's going to be basically like Destiny. How they, you know, they continue with more and more things to do around the, you know, around the planets and stuff. So that's great for this. And it kind of scares me because if it's like Ultimate Alliance, dude, please. We had too many games like Ultimate Alliance. Like, dude, like Marvel Strike. Like, literally the only good games that Marvel has taken out has been... Marvel Clans of the Champions, which is the fighting game on the phone, Marvel Spider-Man, and which other one? I don't know, and all the other Marvel Spider-Mans. So we need a game that has good gameplay like God of War, you know, that, that kind of way, and it'll be amazing. And now what I wanted to talk about uh, was the assemble teams of up to four players. It's gonna be amazing because you're gonna be able to have your own Iron Man with your, his own powers. So I'm not saying having your own like stylized because I don't know if this is true, but on Twitter, this guy put up, he says he works for uh, Crystal Dynamics, I don't know. And he said that there's no gear that you can put on the Marvel characters. and. You know what? That sucks. Because, dude, come on. We're in the point of gaming where gear is, like, one of the best things. You know, you'd love to customize the character on your own way. You know, God of War has it. Spider-Man, you know, has different types of suits. Mortal Kombat, you know, it's that's just the thing that it is now, and if there's no way of like customizing your Thor or Iron Man or Captain America, that's gonna suck. Like maybe Captain America's shield, you know, his helmet, 
something. Boy. I hope that's not true about not having no gear. And then I was wanting to talk about the uh, cinematic storytelling. I don't think I read that piece. Please have a good story. And please do not have Thanos or Ultron as the villain or Apocalypse. Where we had those people. King. Not bad. Galactus. Galactus. Amazing as the main villain. Um, I don't know. Ego the planet. Jesus. Give me that. But please have a good story. I also read a piece where... Uh, basically the Avengers they're all broken and basically the person that gets them all together is um, uh, you know Mrs. Marvel the the other version that she's a little she's a girl yeah that version brings them together I don't know how and then uh, they say that Captain Marvel I think the actual, the real Captain Marvel is there in the game, Hulk and Iron Man. So, all I want to do now is see gameplay and pray that that is defined and it's like third person. Please. Third person. So, I'm going to end the video right here. I didn't have that much to discuss about. Um, all we got to do is hope. Gameplay is going to be revealed like in seven days. I'm going to maybe react, but it might be too long. I don't know, but I'll, I'll figure it out. I'm going to make a video the date of. So, if you guys want it to be a third person game, just like God of War and all the other good games, and for it to have the same mechanics as Destiny, give it likes. Give us thumbs up. Come on. Subscribe, because... I'm going to be posting more information about this game to come. If it is where I don't hope it is. Please. Alright. I'm going to end it right here. Thank you for watching.